Hello there and welcome back to another episode in our modded series. So the focus for this episode actually we're gonna have a few things that I would like to do. So most importantly we are going to expand not necessarily the water tank just yet but this is kind of how I want to raise this hill a little bit. So I don't have the exact blueprint of how I want the things to end up but I do know somewhere around here around those ruins and also on those cliffs as well I do want to have some houses for the for the beep beavers and then uh, with some uh, interesting bridges I would like to cross over from this side all over to the other side where we shall also have some houses I think with these ones we might actually move them more towards middle or or, or this side a little bit more perhaps so that way it might be easier to connect them with uh, or link them up essentially because right now if those bridges continue from here yeah then we'll have to do a bit of a weird L shape so we yeah we, we definitely might move things around just a little bit but we can leave the beavers carry on with putting in some terrain blocks I am thinking since it's a uh, you know I, I tried to make it not very a straight line perhaps and uh, you know Give it a bit, bit of a natural contour line as well but i'm also thinking well we might actually extend this a little bit and i have a bit of a lip over here so it, it's definitely an option so other things whilst we let the beavers continue with the construction we shall also check on the batteries and it seems we are charging them up well actually they aren't discharging right now but at least they're out of the water already i think oh yeah the wind's pretty much did so that's fine and with the production lines as well seems to be operating pretty nicely I think we'll have to turn on the oh yeah these are quite empty so why don't we turn you on again we'll leave a couple of bots in here I think over time we'll probably add some more as well but okay let's move on so it appears if we keep our blank factory operational 24 7 then this forest is is not really a match for our our production levels. I mean, in District 1, we still have a healthy log pile with about almost 2,000 actually in here. So we can't quite complain about it. But then at the same time, you know, I'd, I'd, like, I'd like to see a few more trees to be ready for us. So the easy fix for this could be that we allow the beavers in the forestry district to be the only ones that can cut down these trees I mean most of the lumberjack flags are already paused anyways there's just a couple left in here and there's one over there as well so a total of four I think um, but I think this could be a more suitable spot for us now bringing up the water here will be a bit more interesting but I don't think we have to we could very easily set up something similar that we have over here just a little water drop off zone and then we, I think maybe a couple, maybe three, two or three, spread out over here. And that way we should have this hill fully greened up as well. And then we can put some maples down here. So the way we would like to access this, I think this is probably the only right way. We do love those bridges. And let's see, if we had, maybe the stairs can already start going up from here. I mean, it would be actually a bit more awesome if this bridge goes all the way over and then there's just like a little off zone here. But for now, since we don't have the bigger ones, let's just go a little cheaper, I think. Uh, yeah, that's okay. I think that will do. So we'll set you off right there. We can have another set of stairs to get to the upper level and then here we'll just start harvesting them once and we'll quickly set up a water drop off zone as well all right uh, since it is evening why don't we skip this and then we shall continue with some of the other plants that we have and here we go across these lovely little mountains we have this temporary district where one single column has been pretty busy with all these uh, levees and different networks we do have this dam already in place as well and he or she has already started building another one. I think um, 
since this is going to take quite a bit of time, why don't we actually give you a friend? Because it must be pretty, pretty boring. Why don't we minimum two? Let's do, yep, this way. So we get our second column in here. And what they shall be doing is completing this dam in here. But I also really want them, I actually want to give this a bit of a priority. Cut down this forest so we can lay down another road. And then hopefully get those stairs in place as well. So then we could close off another section just over there. The goal here is really to keep in as much water as possible. And somehow we also do have to reach over there. I mean, if we check the range from the forestry district, the range only goes till about here. I mean, if we cut down this forest here, we could do a district center, I guess somewhere in, in this corner, and then a little log pile uh, right across the street. And then we can just easily walk all the way here and build this dam pretty quickly, I think. Okay, so we'll let the beavers, uh, well, I mean, we'll let the columns carry on with, with this dam over here. And I think... Uh, where did they go? Oh, they're they're here. They haven't disappeared. And yeah, we'll give them a couple of minutes just to finish off all of those trees as well. Okay, I know we're jumping around a little bit, but... You know, there's lots to do. colony has been develop developing pretty nicely. What is it? Another 12 days until the rainy season. And I think... Uh, how much dirt are we producing? So six every four hours. I uh, don't think it's fast enough, but we also don't... Uh, actually, we I, I guess we could spare another column. Uh, science points, 8,300. I think we had more, but I did unlock a few extra things as well, just to have a look at what do we really have. Okay, so what are you guys doing? I don't see any of them up yet. Okay, so you are carrying the dirt over. Okay, I think they have. I definitely see one over here. And I guess we are going to have to give them... <laughs> some platforms over here. So they could walk from the top, I think. Cross over into here. Yeah, that might be better. Okay, let's do a few platforms. This one can go till about here. Okay, there we go. There's a lovely little connection. So they can do a few extra ones as well. And... Alright. Oh, I think we have a bit of a cap in there. This one's a little bit higher. Alright, and there we go. So we'll let them carry on with the construction as well. Let's have a quick look. Have you guys... I'm pretty sure you've already done it. Let's uh, seal you up so no trees will block our way. Okay, so the range here, I know it's all already red. But if it runs still about here, without turning or moving upwards, I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty convinced that we are going to reach all the way there. All right, someone has nothing to do. Uh, that's fine, I guess. We can just pause you for the time being. I believe we had a few more trees in the way. Uh, actually, we shall unpause you. And I do want to remove a few more trees. Are you saying you don't... Oh, it's just out of range. Okay, well, let's skip this night as well. And then we shall be back in the morning. So our lovely little bridge system here seems to be complete already. And what we can do... Actually, we can't go too far just yet. I thought we had a few spare beavers. But what we shall do... We will tell you that this is the highest priority right now. And I think with the beavers themselves as well, I would like the columns to actually come and work from here. All right, there we go. We probably would want to have a bit of a log pile in here as well. And then it's pretty simple. Everything shall be cut down this whole area. I'm not even gonna go around and mark him mark them individually it's uh let's not waste our time this whole zone is to be cut down as quick as you can 
Where are the bots? Oh, they must be running over, I think. Well, we're not gonna find them. Yeah, so we'll leave them to it. I'm sure they will arrive very soon. So all we have to do now is just allow it just a little bit of time. Let's have them cut down as many trees as we can. And once this pine is also removed, then we can place another set of stairs for them to go up. Actually, you have cut down this one, so you have a bit more space now. With the desired, I think we'll turn you off. Nothing to do in the range. Okay, so you have already removed those trees. That is fantastic. You can move on to some other projects. And, well, you look at that. This has been going pretty well as well. And yes, you now have access. I think we can place a few more roads. Oh, this one already has a road. Well, there we go then. And let's have a look. If we were to place a few more... Hmm, this is going to be pretty straight over here, which is uh, not our preferred option. But I think over here, yeah, it's going to have to be a bit more straight. And then I guess we can turn, or maybe even from here. Well, not entirely sure yet. I think we, yeah, these are all red currently. Actually, never mind. In case they are too fast, let me just remove this whole section in here. Okay, there we go. They can uh, complete as many as they can, but don't do the final link until we are or have fully fully decided. All right, what's our dirt situation? About a hundred left. We got mm, <laughs> okay, twenty nine columns right now. I think we can do one more. What's our batteries? Oh, they are almost well, not all the way up, but halfway there. How much power are we feeding through? 6,100, and we are only consuming about 2,400. Okay, I think that's quite a quite a healthy stockpile. Research points have gone up pretty nicely as well, almost at 9,000. Remember, we only need another 1,000 after that until we can put the columns in the assemblers as well. All right. So how have you been? Okay, we can put a bit of a road here, and I think the first water drop-off is going to be somewhere there. Then the uh, second one, I guess actually we could even do it right over here. It might not be a bad idea. Or maybe here. So here's going to be the stairs, which means the road will go somewhere there. We could have the water drop-off station where the tree is right now. And then, oh... Yes, I do remember now. If the water drop-off goes here, we are going to need... Hmm. That might not be the best location after all. And this might be too close. Okay, so... Let's do one first. This one here. Okay, and this tree needs to go as well before we can put the last levy in place. And okay... Let's uh, have a look on the other side of the mountain as well. How are things coming along? So the dam is halfway halfway done, actually, which is not bad at all. And you guys... Oh, this one's already empty. Okay. This means you are carrying logs from all the way there, which is a very, uh, very slow progress. I think what we could do... Uh, let's have a look. Oh, we also have one over here. Why don't we unpause you? No available beavers here. Oh, okay. There we go. Let's do it this way then. And you can be paused. I don't think we are going to need you. Okay. So, for the logs, this is going to be our little supply over here. And I think with them as well, yeah, all of you can go. And I don't really want you to take over, so we shall mark you as well. Okay, there we go. That's That should give us a few closer logs. And that way, I think we'll be able to complete the rest of the TAM before the rainy season starts. 
Okay, so our dirt is still at about 138, which I think that should be fine. Now, let's have a look at another thing. We had a few uh, dirt blocks being... or oh, they were placed over here as well. And this, in my opinion, looks way nicer than these levees right next to us. So what we can do here already... So let's remove all of these levees. And what I'd like to slowly start doing, if we... Uh, what were you holding again? I think... Oh, you are actually empty. You are full. So we have tons of paper here. I think one of you can be paused. This one will leave it as it is. And I would like to move some of those paper factories over so that way we can complete that section there as well. Alright, so the first one can go, go here. Uh, I think our gear situation, yeah, 630 blanks over a thousand. Okay, that's gonna last quite some time. Oh, one second. I think we almost forgot about our design choices. So I feel platforms and actually it would be nicer if the ladder was a little bit closer but we'll leave it for the time being. It also appears we are changing our power network a little bit. Actually, let's pause you for a second and think about it. We can avoid this link completely if we change you up a little bit. So let's put the universal one just like so. You are going to go up and then connect with the, with the building. And right, so what we were deciding to do here is change it up a little bit. It's um, not really nice how it cuts off our road, just like so. So let's step down. And now, there we go. All right, we'll let the beavers complete this section here as well. And then uh, we'll be able to sever this link over here and get rid of the rest of the power shafts. All right, lovely. Now, where shall we head next? Let's have a look at our tree farm. Okay, so we do have a few trees coming up, but they will be cut down pretty swiftly, I think. So, yeah, it's all right. We'll leave you there. I think right now their well-being is actually not too bad. Yep, 27. They've got... Oh, you haven't had, you haven't had time to go to the campfire or rooftop terraces. I mean, they already have to work uh, one hour less, but uh, I'm sure we'll be able to fix it up in the future. All right, a few extra trees have been moved out, so we can have the stairs just over there. And I was thinking, once we get this station up and running, we could even try and do the second one. I guess somewhere here will be fine as well. Uh, depends how... We yeah, let let's see. All right, someone's got nothing to do. Oh, that's fine. Let's uh, pause another flag so we should have an extra. Oh, seven. Hmm. Yeah, we, we are definitely going to need the columns working in the assembler all night. I mean, 9,500 points right now. So we should have it pretty, uh, pretty soon. I guess another day will do it. And then we'll be fine. All right, so whilst the columns and the beavers are busy with everything else... I think it's a good time to unpause this building here. And actually, let's not pause the game. We would like to. Actually, you are already marked, which is very good. Let's mark the other side as well. And where were you? Okay, right here, you have the range. But it appears there's quite a few trees within your range. So, <laughs> shall we send you a little bit of help? I guess it wouldn't be a bad idea. If we do... Oh, we don't need to get to that side. Right, so let's give it the highest priority. Let's have it constructed as quick as we can. And then we can do a, another district center with a log pile here to complete the dam. All right, so that's good. Let's have a look at the uh, dirt as well. Okay, are you able to build those? I think we have access diagonally over there. Uh, they haven't quite reach this area yet but that is fine it's coming along pretty uh, pretty nicely already all right batteries that's always very interesting and there we go 
they are already at 46,000 hamster power, so that's uh, magnificent. Dirt pile seems to be going up very nicely as well. There's about 164 now. And I think, uh, yeah, this section is also complete. Can unpause this paper mill now. And let's have it constructed. And I'm trying to remember, oh yeah, we did the paper mills here because we wanted to start producing some dynamites. Remember, we are definitely going to deepen this pool. I think about another seven levels. And the reason why I say seven is right now it is three levels deep. I would very much like to use, where are they? Metal floodgates. We can go up to ten. So I do want this pool to be at least uh, ten levels deep. Yeah, that's what our goal is. As long as we build it and plan it out smartly enough, we'll have this whole area still very green. But we just want to have the ability to release a bit more water when and when we want to. Okay, so that is all fine. This power section is going nicely as well. Uh, this we haven't really done much about or changed it up just yet but that's because we are waiting for this area okay so you are out of range i do understand that let's have a look if we start bringing the road this way okay you are within range now and if we check real quick as well it is starting to get pretty red but i think i'm quite confident that we shall be able to reach all the way there Oh, is this full already? Oh, yes it is. Okay. Fair enough. We are going to have to put some additional log piles. I have a feeling it could have also been our hauling team. Actually, let's not place you there. Let's uh, do one just like so. And maybe we should just change up the roads a little bit. Yeah, this one can go from here. And then all the way down. Okay. Way better this way. Seems the whole team has come over to uh, finish off the construction here because I believe they've got absolutely nothing to do. Alright, and with this district in uh, here as well, I think uh, now that everything is constructed, all the levees I mean, I don't think we really need you anymore. So let's see how far can we can we get if we got the link. Okay, this gate can go, let's put a road real quick. Alright, there we go, and this gate is also unnecessary. Okay, I know you're going to complain because you don't have access, but do you know what? It's fine. It is okay. So they can go all the way here, and that is fantastic. We can leave the flowers how they are right now, and in here, I think think we can already start growing a few extra trees. I don't want you to be there. And I think we can go even further, can we not? Let's have a quick look. Alright. Uh, no, this is about the end of, of our road network. Uh, what would probably be better is if we continue this road through here and then to the left a little bit so that way they would also have a bit of range on this hill as well yeah this might be better and let's see from the top we'll just do a couple of roads as well just to see how far can we really go if they go straight or directly from the district center all right so if we do a flag somewhere here Let's quickly check. Oh, this. Yep, they are definitely going to cover most of the hill here. Alright, that is all very lovely indeed. Now, these flags are not going to reach all the way. So let's do another one. Yep, that should cover most of it. And we can also do the same. Yeah, I guess here would be fine, fine as well. Alright, so this side will be sorted very quickly. I just really want you guys to finish that one off and you can be changed over. Let's put a column in that one since you have a bit um, 
bigger range. And is the other one. The other one's almost complete as well. So let's uh, swap you out. Call him in that one. Two beavers can be in this one during daytime. And I just really want you guys to start with the... Or reach the furthest ones as quickly as possible. Alright. And... Okay, so you've got a few before you reach the... Our little water drop-off or the planned water drop-off zone. Alright, we'll leave you at that and we'll be back in the morning. Here we go. The dam seems to be halfway there. And how is our log pile doing? Quite a few logs in here. The dead trees are also almost cut down. You haven't quite reached the wooden stairs yet. Actually, the materials are already in, which is great. If we had the... Oh, 9,800 points. Okay, we are very close. I know I thought it's going to happen yesterday, but I'm pretty sure. I'm 100% sure. 99, actually. Nothing is ever 100%. So we're going to have the science points today. We'll unlock the assembler, put a couple of columns in there, and then, uh, yeah, we'll be popping out those columns way twice as quick, I suppose. All right, dirt is fine as well. Numbers going up. Uh, we can probably take one column out if we really wanted to. I guess we could, but I don't think we're going to do it just yet. Alright, so you're quite busy here as well. I know we have a few builders that are available. So let's have a look what else we can do. With this zone in here, if you rem remember from one of the previous episodes, I did talk about, uh, or a little about, how I'd like to change this zone up a little bit. Okay, so since we don't have dirt here and I don't think we want to construct another terraforming station. Yeah, it takes 200 treated blanks and we only have 46 right now. So we are going to have to use some levees in here. Oh, this is very inconvenient. You are right in the way. Okay, why don't we actually... Would it be a good idea to... Put you above water. I think it might be. So where else? No, you're just gonna go here, right? So why don't we place you? I mean, if we want to future-proof ourselves, we might want to do another one there. Why don't we do one? Let's see. You are three by three. No. Three at the front. Something like this, isn't it? And then you guys can hop here. One more. And I think we need another platform. Oh, we missed one. There we go. Alright, let's go to labor distribution post. And now we have it. Okay. What would also be lovely, all these beavers here don't really have any decoration, so... Actually, we are going to place a few more platforms and... Yeah, pop, pop down a few uh, few decorations there as well. So we'll leave you guys with it. Uh, with this one, you are going to want an access, but it doesn't have... It's not in deep water just yet. So I think we can cut the link in here. Ooh, how shall we do it? Should we... Every bit of space... Mm, yeah, it would be important, right? So, okay. Levies go through just like so. And since you are not crossing over yet, this zone here, I think it's also fine to change you around a little bit. Right, so let's do you... Yeah, I think we'll do it this way. Okay. And another levy can go right about there. And here's our alternative access to the to the littles once they get some water of course now with this section is it is going to be a little bit trickier of course we can uh, <laughs> now let's remove them i have a feeling they are gonna expand all over the place now right so then uh, you can go out once the platforms are completed this one very easy to move over as well i think we can actually already delete you. Yep, off you go. Find another job somewhere else. Uh, here, we're also going to have to move a few things. We got a few sick beds. 
Okay, they should be pretty straightforward. Actually, we've got quite a quite a few in here. Let's do yep, a couple in there. And I think with the water tank, if we set you to empty, then you can move out of our way as well. Rows will need to be readjusted. But that should be the least of our worries. Uh, I guess the second question would be uh, how far do we want to go? In theory, we... Hmm. I guess in, in long term, it will be cool if this whole area is covered. Actually, never mind. I don't want those levees to stick out like a sore thumb. So, this space will actually be used for the trees. Yep. Let's do it this way. You're gonna go there, right? We can already cut this road as well and put the levees down just like so. Alright, there we go. Uh, let's have a look how are things up here as well. So the last of the trees is now finally coming out. Which means we can close you up with the... Uh, hold on a second. Let's grab the water. We are gonna need the water cage just like so. Water dump, but you shall be paused. No, both of you shall be paused until this is built. And yeah, I guess the stairs will go there. Alright, well, we are going to have to check the range though. Ooh. Okay. No good. <laughs> right, right, right. So this is as far as it goes, isn't it? Let me just double check. Alright, district center. Uh, wait, we are fine. So they can go all the way here, which means the stairs will be fine. Oh, almost. I was almost about to delete this whole thing and bring it a little bit closer, but we are, we're okay. Well, you look at that. The batteries are almost complete now. So that is fantastic. I mean, we have quite a few buildings paused here as well, but it, it's been, uh, I think it's been working out pretty great. I mean, the additional, what is it, six or seven, eight windmills definitely help us out, but I think we've found a pretty decent balance already. Uh, you're now built as well, which means, are you empty? Oh, no, you're not. And that's because we are not really consuming any of that paper in, in here just yet. Hmm. Actually, never mind. We can, we can leave them be. We've got quite a few projects going on right now and uh, it seems the science points have reached 10,000 now so let's do it here we go all the points are now gone and we have bots for working in the assembler finally which means we'll be sending more columns out even faster well I guess it's two times faster than before. Right, why isn't this built yet? I thought we have enough construction uh, columns and beavers in here. Yep, that's pretty good stats over there. Got enough enough of a workforce it seems. Uh, yeah, we definitely want to have this first one done uh, quickly so that way we can uh, sort of measure out how far do we need to go and I think it would be actually smarter to do one at the top there so that way this whole area can be green as well but let's let's just see first let's see how it goes with this one here and okay there we go are you finally bringing logs we're gonna need a few planks as well but i think i already see one one beaver bringing some over all right let's leave you at that let's have a look very lovely indeed just a few a few left you have the log, so everything is good. And then you can move over to this little project here as well. Okay, that is good. Let's have a look in here. Trees are mostly gone. I am just blocking this in because I don't want new trees to start growing just yet. Okay. Oh, we do have two beavers in here. Okay, that's very good. And as soon as they've taken out the last of the trees... Did I mark everything? I did mark everything. Well, there we go. As soon as the last of them are gone, then we can put down the district center as well. And uh, I'm surprised they're not full yet. 
Okay. Right, let's have a look at this enormous wall that is being built. Okay, that's not too bad. I know it's going to take a little longer. Well, they have done the bottom levels already. Actually, there's a few more left in there. So if they get stuck and... Uh, I mean, yeah, eventually it is going to slow down a little bit. Unless we, of course, put some more platforms in here. But I don't think it's going to be necessary. I mean, this whole area isn't... Isn't like a top priority. I mean, it kind of... I do want to have this living area sorted, but... It's fine. We've got other little projects that are a little bit more important right now. Yeah, the dirt piles aren't going very nicely, so I think we... I think it's pretty safe to take one out for now at least. I mean, we can always ramp up the uh, production, so... Yeah, we're not too worried. Okay, this should be done now. Alright, there we go. Highest priority. And we shall do the same with you as well. You can be on pause now. Okay, and the slightly higher one for you. Okay, beautiful. Done. Uh, I think... Are you guys too busy or do we not have enough builders? We do not. Okay, that's good to know. Actually, there's eight plus one column in here. Right, but we uh, we shall be getting columns now way faster. I mean, it's still 36 hours, but... You know, working day and night... And keeping them operational is absolutely amazing. I guess the second thing we should might have to worry about is the power. Because if there's no wind... Oh, yeah. Okay. I think it's time to fix our power needs as well. So the first thing we should probably do here... I think all of them were only two levels... Yeah, I think I would prefer to bring the power th through this canal, so the, the cables are a little hidden. But I think we also have a bit of a problem here. We do. This site is a little too far. How shall we do it? I think we might just be within range. If it wasn't... Or maybe not. Oh, it is just out of range. Actually... Let's not worry about this. We can still bring the power lines through. Oh no, they can't construct this corner here. Okay. Yeah, that's a little too far for those beavers. And this one here as well. Okay, I'm gonna have to do a bit of thinking whilst we have the night time and hopefully I have a solution by morning. Alright, I think I do have the, the answer. So, if we look at this, from the district center, they have to step to the left one, two, two times here, and they go straight. Turn to the right, go up one more to the left. So that's three. If we had one, or from even from here actually, no, 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 this is the main road. One, two, three, or from here, one, two, three, then we could have this section constructed. But that still leaves us with the power cables that would have to run from there. So if we take a look at you real quick. They will be able to construct the, the power wires. If they were on top. Or actually you are already. Let's see. That's pretty straight isn't it? I mean technically speaking we would have a bit, of, bit more range. If they didn't have to go all the way this way. Hmm. Well, let me see. They could go in from here. Was it one, two, three, four? One, two, three, four. Okay, let's try this. Real quick. We'll get rid of uh, the trees in here. And this might just give us the range to complete these platforms. Another thing what we might do is... We might tell them not to plant in the corners. And actually also in here. Because we might just have to put platforms in those corners. Yeah, we might. Let's speed up this real quick. Oh, actually, never mind. We may have problems in here. Okay, right. You are done now. Uh, so let's set it up again. Advanced. All right. 
Pause when below. No. Pause when above. Let's say... Four should be fine. And then unpause when below. Let's do... Three. Okay, so now we should have someone working here and they will green this up very quickly all right so the hill side seems to be actually wait wait a second oh you can't reach them oh i see so how about we give you a bit more range over here then you should be able to get rid of the rest of the trees as well all right there we go get this one constructed as well and now we shall have water. You guys can be paused for now. Alright, that's not bad at all. That's half the hill done. There was another one. Oh yeah, we are going to need three. So, <laughs> what is our range again? So, if it is up here, I still do want to have... Hmm, let's uh, kind of visualize it a little bit. Put a few rows in here as well, so it's going to be easier to see how far they can go. Okay, all the way. We do want this to be green as well, so perhaps... Access-wise, let's grab the levees. I do want them to go here. I want to hide this a little bit. Okay, no. No. I don't like this. Alright, let's try this again. So, stairs can go up from here, few levees, and that means you can go, you can go. This one's going to be paused. The water gauge is going to be... Actually, hold on a second. If we do it here, mm, a little closer, that covers the rest of the hill, and even more in here. Yeah, maybe that's how we should look at this. Okay, everything off for now. We'll put this road back. And now let's grab the district center. We can only go this far. Which means the water drop-off is literally going to have to be somewhere here. Okay, one, two left. If it goes up just like so, then we can have this water drop off here and I think we might not cover everything potentially all right water gauge just like so and we need one more levy but we shall pause you for a second I just want to make sure the gauge is done I mean I guess they can do it from the top as well but then we have to give them additional access over here yeah let's just do it this way all right uh you're not done yet let's give you a slightly high priority because i think yes they have been doing this levee wall in here so that one's coming along nicely as well and well you look at that i don't think we need this many beavers in here you can be paused actually and the only district where we are sending things right now is this one so they need biofuel they also do want to have a few blanks and I think the last thing we had in here was logs wasn't it all right let's do a quick check yep fuel blanks logs and the rest is irrelevant right now stock okay so you got a few things in here but hopefully we can oh we are gonna have to delete those routes okay there you go and I really hope they can empty this as well all right there we go I guess another thing we could perhaps try in here is this road. If we... You know what? Let's do it. If we get rid of you, right? And we shall delete these trees as well. Let's give you a, a highest priority. Okay. Now, these lumberjacks can move. All right. We'll place another two real quick as well. There you go. One over there. One over there. What's your priorities like? They are nothing special. Alright. So that way we can bring the road through. And perhaps give them a slightly more direct route. Wait a second. We don't have to delete it. If we can just cut you down. 
Yep, that might be a little bit easier. Okay, so this one can be deleted. Same with you. And now let's bring this road through and see what happens. Okay. Right, well, there we go. That's definitely a little bit more direct. There is still... Well, if we went straight through here, we could go even a bit further. But I think this is already enough to do... Let's see. There's one over there, one over here. These guys are now... Oh, they have actually already constructed most of that stuff. So that's good. Nothing to do in range. Let's have a look. Okay, so the hill is now clear on that side. You still have a few trees left. Yes, you do. Okay, let's leave you be for a second. Okay, so maybe we don't need... Hmm. No, let's do one more just for good measure so you can go about there that will be fine right and i think with your range as well you can do everything till about here it would be lovely if we could extend it and i mean yes we can if we bring let's say this road directly through actually let's start from here we are gonna have to build um, <laughs> yeah, we're going to have to get rid of a few trees, which is fine. And to save cost on the blanks, we could have a road go through there. This one can cross over from here. Okay, now it's going to go straight through over here, there. And then, yeah, sorry trees. We are going to need a little bit more direct route to help us construct the almighty new power network. Alright, how shall we do it? Well, it's going to be a few platforms either way. So perhaps... Okay, there we go. I think this will be fine. And I do want this to be done first. We are going to need to cross over... In here as well. Okay, there we go. Make sure we put a road down there as quick as we can. Oh, you guys are pretty fast, aren't you? Okay, and in here, I guess we can cut straight through, can't we? Yeah, we sort of have to. Okay. It's a bit of a shame to get rid of all those trees, but... It's fine. Uh, you have loads of logs. Oh, we do have a few spare columns as well. Totally missed that. Anyways, they can wait for a little bit whilst we do this. Okay, there we go. That one's done. Road goes through. And the same with this one. Any second, just get rid of the last of the trees. Okay, the we... Hmm. Actually... I think we need those columns here. Yes, we do. So bring them in. All right. Forestry needs... I think we had this. Three spare ones, right? Okay. So there we go. Oh, wait. There is still one... One spare. So let's bring you to 20... 29. Okay. Wonderful. Whilst we add it, let's uh, check the dirt as well. Plenty. Nothing to do in range. Okay. Well, why don't you climb down from here? Rest of you is done, which is great. Let's. Uh, oh, we can attach you already. Well, that's good. Um, pause when above. Nope. Wrong one. I think four was fine. And then unpause when below. Let's say. I'd say three. Okay, there we go. So this area is looking very nice and lovely, which means we can already start placing some trees. So you... Oh, wait a second. All of these roads can go. Now, since we have a bit of extra access here, let's grab you again, the forester. If we want to cover this whole area, Yep. This 
Oh, no. Alright. That's the spot. There we go. So you're gonna go straight over there. We shall grab all the maples in here. Yep, we can fill this whole area. So you're gonna have something to do at least. There are actually a few spare rows in here as well that we can get rid of. Alright, there we go. Gives us a bit more space for a couple extra maple trees. And will you look at that. You're almost done as well, but we can leave you for a second. Actually have this done so we can get that column out from there. And let's have a look at this one here. Alright. Dynamite is in. And let's do one more. Alright. Still out of range, but that's fine. Uh, let's... Uh, oh, right. We still have this link in here as well. All for the greater good. Or so they say. Okay. Pretty right. Okay, so we've got an... Uh, Slightly more direct route, it seems. They have definitely connected up from here. And uh, that's still you. Did we not highlight you? Oh, no, we did not. Okay. And that's the last of them. All right, let's unmark this section here as well. Is anyone working? Yes, they are. Beautiful. And will you look at that? The tam is now complete. Way ahead of the schedule. Let's hide the water. You are already doing the stairs got logs nearby blanks yes you have to run a little a little further away uh, but let's see if we if we pause you for a second all right maybe we can reach this area a little bit quicker all right trees are now done as well which means we can finally all right let's uh take a look at this we are gonna need a district center and both of them are actually pretty a uh, lovely spot so it doesn't matter too much but we shall oh we need a drop off zone as well and the distribution center Ooh, okay fine actually we don't need the log pile do we not just yet you can probably go i don't think you need it anymore at least in here and this one can become a gate for us okay now we can connect you up and there we go all right so the drop-off zone can be just over here you are just gonna need a road there we go and the bigger question is where shall the distribution center go i think the only space we have is right here oh you are a little you are a little bit too big it seems so not to worry let's do it this way right get to building let's have this done as quick as we can now work is wise are we gonna have enough beavers here actually yeah we're pretty good okay so this hill here you are done that means okay not to worry, we can place you right over here. Okay, let's finish this one off as well. We can call it a day. Let's think about it. I th hmm, was it here? One, two, this one, this one. All right, I think we are good now. And the water gauge, and we are also gonna need the water drop off. Okay, wonderful. So that means the whole hill is going to be lovely and green all over, uh, minus this part over here, but don't look at that. Uh, the rest of it, however, we got some trees already growing as well. This zone in here, well, this is going to be our maple syrup farm. Can't pause you because you are not really planting anything anymore, and I think Oh, there are actually a few trees that we don't want here. Alright, so these ones can go. We'll plant a few more maples there. And the reason why we moved it over is... I think uh, soon enough, this whole zone here might be under water. Yep, might be submerged. Okay, so the coots are now out. 
I think we are also gonna empty you, I'm afraid. Yep, you are gonna have to go. And this one is done, which means the road can go. Oh, a little tricky over here, but not to worry. Can probably cut you out just like so. We shall move the roads over by one. Stairs up. Connect you. And beautiful. Okay. Now we can delete all those. Yep. Little sidestep there, but it will do. Okay, and all these ones can be now placed as well. I guess the next question really is how to place those farms and stuff. But, um, you know, that's a problem for another day. Alright, let's see how you guys have been doing. All the stairs are now in. 3.4 days left until the rainy season. They are already constructing the dams, which is great. Okay, and let's take a look at you as well. You're ready. Distribution post is ready. We don't need this many beavers in here. But you, however... Uh, we don't have any spare columns just yet, but uh, let's set you up. So you are District 14. Oh wow, that's quite a few. Minimum, we shall take two in here. And now, what to export? Alright, let's add a new route. They are going to need some biofuel. And right off the bat, what we do want to do... We don't need a ton of it. If we have, let's say, 30 here at all times we shall be fine and you're also going to need um no let's make our own logs over here okay yep we shall cut down just a few more trees i don't want you taking them uh okay there we go right so that's going to give us a couple of trees well they are going to need some planks as well to climb up the river banks it seems so let's do this real quick okay and blanks all right limits we are not gonna need this many i mean we've got tons of it in the storage but uh wait a second all right let's select the limit and blanks are here so high i think 10 will be fine all right there we go and one of you can actually stop working in here. Start cutting down those logs because we are going to need them for our dam construction. Yeah, that's quite a few. How many logs do you have now? 500. Okay. So why don't you send the logs as well? Hopefully speed it up just a little bit. Okay, someone else has nothing to do in the range. Let's have a look. Okay, that's uh, all the trees gone now. We can remove... All the zones. Beautiful. Everything is nice and green. You can be on post. Now, how do we want this road to go through? I don't think it's going to be exactly like this in here. Uh, if we place you... How far do you need to go? So... This will be fine. Plus it... Hmm, covers a little bit up there as well. And you cover most of it. Okay, we can do probably another road from here and then let them climb up. Yep, let's do that. So we shall place you. There we go. Here will be fine as well. Right next to this construction. Hopefully hides it a little bit. And then, uh, yeah, we are just going to have to change up the roads a little bit. Uh, don't worry, it's not going to stay this, uh, this way. Stairs as well, as promised right over there bit more direct route uh, one second we are gonna have to attach you and set it up pause when above let's say we were four before and this one was three okay there we go where are you okay you're bringing some water from there and I think rest of it is done and well you look at that quite a bit of extra range that we managed to get from there if we detonate you let's have another look actually how far can you go so this is not bad at all not bad at all okay another thing we can do here 
Let's see, we've got a few platforms in already. Let's bring this road across as well. Maybe we can complete the last dynamite. I mean, if we really wanted to, we could also sever one of those links and let them climb over. But we shall just try from this side first. View should be now deep enough, which means platform just like so. All right. Oh, okay, so it's not going to save us a lot. And this corner is still tricky. Oh, well. I mean, yeah, this one's pretty far. At least we can do all... Everything inside this canal here. Up until this, this point, of course. And then if we check this one again... I mean, I guess... If we were to allow them to climb over. Okay, so you can be detonated. Platform can go there. Put a road a little further as well. Let's grab you one more time. And... Hmm. Okay, if we move you over a little bit, maybe you could climb down. I don't know. I mean, this one's pretty direct as well. But is it gonna cover this whole area? That I don't think we know. Let's uh, try something else. If we place this road here... Alright, it seems we're starting to lose some water. In the canal at least, but that's okay. So, there we go. You can go up until here. And you can... Oh, it's just a little corner here. Okay. Right, I think we have it. If we manage to place a platform here. And the power line on top of it. Okay. Can they reach this one? Yes, they can. Alright. Actually, once this one is done, maybe they can go a little further. I think we're almost fine, aren't we? Alright, get this done. And let's see if they connect up. No, they do not. Uh, okay, never mind. Platform here. No one can construct this. Okay, we ha do have some time, however. What about now? Okay, now you can do it. Do we have to do it now? Is, is there... Is another question. No, we do not. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay, that was painful. So what we shall do is we are going to bring you down, actually. Okay. There we go. And all this really is now. Oh, yeah, we're going to have to start with the furthest ones. Uh, okay, so that's going to be painful. But anyways, we, I think we've done everything we wanted to do in this episode. So batteries are looking good. We've got a different link in here. Just need to tidy this up. And this is coming along pretty nicely as well. We've figured out the power connection. We can now drag it to the uh, District 1. We'll, uh, we only have 1.9 days left. But we are definitely going to get this through. We also have this new tree farm that is going up on this hill. Which wasn't really utilized before. But now we have a bit of a, bit of a purpose for it. Which also means this zone will be dedicated to the forestry district and all the uh, cutting down will happen over there, I think. We'll post them, we'll leave the infrastructure as it is. But uh, yeah, that's going to be for District 1. I know it's a bit of an overkill, but you know, it's uh, at least the, the hill will look a bit more busy, just like this one over here as well. Okay, so that's done. We've moved the district center, not the district center, the distribution post as well a little bit further, which means we now have space to start our new water plants farm. So that goes there. We've got a dam in place. Same in here. And this one's almost done. Not a district center in here. This dam is also going into place. And whilst all of that was happening, we now also have this sort of expansion of the hillside. I mean, I know it doesn't look like a lot right now, but let's let's give it some time. We'll uh, definitely have a lovely little accommodation arrangement for the beavers here in the future, and uh, we'll, we'll also have some hanging uh, housing for them as well. But okay, I think we are happy to close the series. Uh, I know this one's a little bit longer, but I just really wanted to have most of the little projects done. So that way, uh, you know, yeah, we'll test out the slightly longer episode, see how it goes. But okay, let's cut the episode here now. 
So thank you so much for watching. Thanks for your lovely comments as well. I really do love reading them. And I shall see you in the next episode. <laughs>